Şu an dükkan dükkan üstüne bırakmadılar. Bir yapı daha yıkıldı. The heart of Hasan Cave has been taken out by force against the will of the people. Excavators in a town in southeastern Turkey that is 12,000 years old. The historic town of Hasan Cave will soon be submerged under 60 meters of water because of a huge new dam. Our observer Ercan Ayboa comes from the region and has been fighting the dam for years, defending the rights of the local residents. This impacts the people, because the people are still there, they are living while all this has happened. The trauma would say maybe many years ago they didn't um, foresee so much, but now they are experiencing it. They're experiencing trauma because of what is 60 kilometers further downstream on the Tigris River, the Ilisu Dam, 135 meters high, more than a decade to complete. The Turkish government says it will create 10,000 jobs and revive the local economy. The water, though, will bury Hassan Kaif forever. I'm involved in the campaign against Sidi Sudan and for Hassan Kaif since uh, 13 years, but for two years I'm not living anymore there, unfortunately, because of political reasons. So friends have uh, shared their feelings, information and videos, what has happened there. Uh, the shop owners uh, have uh, showed intensive reaction uh, because it's a livelihood. They are forced to leave, but without any proper options and alternatives for income restoration in New Hassan Kip. So as a form of protest, they uh, burned their own furniture when they had to leave and police came with the machines. And there have been some important, impressive videos how the people say, if you kick out us here, then Let's burn everything. New Hassan Kaif is the name given to the new town that's been built for Hassan Kaif's residents. Houses, stores, schools, all in shiny new concrete, and even a few select monuments from the old town in the hope that tourists might still come. The justification is to remove one of the seven monuments to new Hassan Kaif, which will be outside of the planet reservoir. There have been and there are big protests at the grounds uh, against the Ilisu Dam. It has been stopped several times. We challenged it so much, but the government always continued with it. And one reason for them is that the dam has a geopolitical dimension. And they plan to use the Ilisu Dam as a weapon against Iraq. And this is unacceptable. The government is planning to build a second dam further down the river for irrigation. There's concern in neighboring Iraq that the dams could be used to hurt their supply of precious water. The Ilisu Dam is a crime in our view. Uh, Hassan Kif, um is important not only for the local people, not only for the Kurds or the Turks. It is important for all people around the world. Chance to stop it is small, it is very small. Uh, but uh, we don't give up. The dam started retaining water in August. So far, the level has risen 50 meters, enough to flood villages further downstream. If nothing is done, the water is expected to reach Hassan Kaif in the summer of 2020.